Multiplus dash to inverter. Serbo GX. GX touch. Negative plug cable. Socket set. Positive plug cable. Communication line between battery and Serbo GX. Communication line between inverter and Serbo GX. First use a tool such as a socket set to loosen the positive and negative battery stud screws of the inverter. Connect the copper nose of the positive battery plug wire and the positive terminal of the Serbo GX power cord to the positive terminal of the inverter, and fasten the screws. Similarly, connect the copper nose of the negative battery plug wire and the negative terminal of the Serbo GX power cord to the negative terminal of the inverter and screw on. Finally tighten with sleeve tool. If you are connecting multiple battery packs to the inverter through the bus, you can also connect the Serbo GX positive and negative power cables to the bus. Insert the positive and negative plug wires into the positive and negative terminals of the battery according to the mark or color. When inserting the wires, hold the button on the plug, and then insert them. Insert the communication cable battery end between the battery and the Serbo GX into the master battery packout communication port. Insert the communication cable between the battery and Serbo GX inverter end into the Serbo GX BMS CAN port. And insert the end of the communication cable into the Serbo GX VE dot bus port. Plug the GX touch cable into the HDMI and USB ports on the Serbo GX. Finally, plug in the Serbo GX's power cord. Connect one end of the network cable used for communication between the inverter and Serbox to the VE.bus port of the inverter. The communication cable used is a standard network cable. Select the communication protocol by setting DIP switch. For Victron, keep all DIP switches in OFF state down state. Open the waterproof junction box. Turn the battery pack on. Wait for a while, and we can see that the Serbo GX turns on correctly and shows that the battery pack is connected. With GX Touch, we can see that the battery pack and inverter have been properly connected. Click Battery Pack, Details, we can see the battery pack details.